Hey guys, I'm going to show you the smart way to style your menu in real time because in most cases it's super common that you cannot select the selector because of like the behavior of the menu. Um, so to start with, we need to set up a JavaScript code to set a debugger statement so you can style your menu. Um, without that this this thing in here will be paused as well when we enable or we re, we run the debugger um code or debugger statement so to start with you go you inspect your elements right click inspect the elements and then click on console tab and let's clear that so okay so i would so let's say set actually i'm gonna create a con so if i want to rerun that um timeout that debugger i can easily you know call the, the the cons instead instead of rewriting the whole code so let's write cons and then uh, let's say um menu debug and then let's open up a uh, um arrow function and then we will set a another arrow function for our callback and then okay inside that arrow function should be so this is like the like the syntax that you need to follow so i'm gonna set up another so i'm gonna set up another arrow function and we will set a statement called debugger and then with a delay of let's say 4000 or something and then we can now call this cons debug and then like that as i said you can always write this instead instead of like wrapping it with a cons but like if I want to rerun, you know, this code again, I don't want to keep writing this code. I prefer to just write the cons. So like if you notice in here, once this, once you write this code, you can copy paste that. I'm zooming it for your, yeah, so this one. So you can copy paste that. You'll see that your, your window or your page has this debug or something. So if I'm gonna right click it, Let's just click on resume. So I'm gonna inspect elements and then you'll notice, okay, so you, you inspect the elements first and then I'm gonna go in. So make sure that when you inspect the elements, I forgot, it's kind of confusing. Make sure when you inspect the elements, this menu thing is opened and then, so this menu thing is open, right click and then you go into the console tab. So we already write the code, right? So we already write the set timeout. Now, as I said, I don't want to rewrite this all over again. That's why I wrap it a cons inside the set timer. So if I'm gonna do menu, so the bug, so we will just, you know, um, call that. And if you go in, in here, your console tab, you'll see that like, it's already open like this is already open if you want to make changes you just need to go into the elements and boom like here so you don't need to it's easier for you so let's say you're going to turn that into red super easy to do so yeah that's how easy it is and then i can just go into my child that css and make changes so it's could help you make your you know your flow faster so this is my process again you can always just always just run this sit this 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 code or if you want to rerun the cons with we find it well whichever whichever you think is better for you feel free to use it so yeah hope it helps and again if you have any question let me know comment down below thank you